Hey everyone, it is me, TNT, and I am back with another episode on the TazCraft server. That's correct, right? Yes. Okay, great, yeah. I am joined by Taz. He's going to give us a quick tour. Or not quick tour, it's probably going to be full episode, but uh, he gave me a lot of stuff to start out with, which is awesome. I really appreciate it. And yes, I did accidentally make two le leggings. Don't don't judge me. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> let's get started on the tour. <laughs> uh huh. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay. Great. Let's go see your base. I will go to my base. Um. Okay. Okay. <laughs> So th Ooh, we're actually in a volcano that I made. If you drop down over here, Ooh. there's the water break at the bottom. Nice, nice. And then just come through here. On the opposite side right there is the way back up. Oh, I don't have my depths trying to boots anymore. I miss them so much. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this is going to be awful. I have to go get I, all my I was tour. taking Sabrina on a tour of the server, and I went to save her, and a gas shot the gravel underneath me, and I lost everything. Oh, that's awful. So over there, we don't need to go over there, but if you look at that giant square on the wall, um, that's going to be featured in my next video. But uh, that's where I'm going to build Taz Manor. Ooh. Uh, right now... Uh, my secret base is right here, although it's not secret anymore. Everyone knows about it. <laughs> Isn't that but the all secret bases? You have to have the secret key to open it. Oh, oh. So go ahead and go down. Yeah, I made one of these. Before it closes on you. Uh oh. <laughs> uh, you took my key. <laughs> oh my gosh, I did. <laughs> That's okay, go up the ladder, and there will be a button. There you go. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, Here. I can't get in now. It fell back down. <laughs> there you go. Oh, oh there's my so key. secret. Oh. Okay, yeah. So anyway, um, this is my room. Nice, my nice. nether wart farm is pretty small. Do you have one uh, bed sleeping thing enabled? Or Okay. Yes. Okay. Nice. Yeah. Uh, in here, this used to be my farm. And then I made a chicken farm way in the top of the waterfall. So if you need some chicken, go ahead and grab a stack or oh. something in there. Wow, nice. Yeah. I'm... Um. And then if you come down here, so originally I was gonna have my bedroom in here, uh, and then it's lower half slab, so I get this really nice view, right? Yeah, I love but it. But with the bed being next to all these lower half slabs, it never counted as a spawnable space. Oh. So unless I lit it up, I I couldn't be in here. So. That's why my room moved upstairs. <laughs> my daughter, who got on the server for a little while, uh, hold on, got it. Wait, was it? Oh. Uh, she had me make her a bedroom, so, so I made this room for her to make her feel like she wasn't underground. I made that little outdoor, you know, the sun rising over the mountains, and mm. then gave her this fish tank. And then if you... Oh, you got your buds. Okay. Perfect. Alright, so... What, what, <laughs> now what they left. This? So coming down this way, this is just a small little uh, slime farm I made. Oh. Uh, I usually make farms more, you know, just to meet my needs. It doesn't have to be these ginormous things that, you know, feed end world hunger and all that stuff. <laughs> uh, so fun. as you can see, it's only three layers there. But if you drop down and go in these doors, you'll see that it produces enough for me. In fact, I'm going to be opening a, a slime store at, at uh, the shop. So in the very bottom chest, hey, that's nice. what it's been in doing. So it takes care of all my needs. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I always want to make a slime farm. I've never really got to it, though, so. As long as you get a slime chunk, they're not hard. <laughs> yeah. I don't really... You just you look up, like, seed finder, like, slime chunks, right? Yeah. And so the seed of this server has been secret from everyone, except me, because I own it, of course. <laughs> but, uh, um, you know, I've been more than happy to 
uh, like I've put in the Discord, I put maps, you know, showing the the land and uh, also telling I don't know if there was a slime chunk near them, if there was. So, yeah, this is my little... It's actually expanded. It used to only be a six-tree tree farm, but now it's a nine-tree tree farm. Nice, nice. And even though lots of the people made fun of me for putting it in here, they use it a lot, <laughs> which is kind of weird because it's not hard to make nine trees. So then if we come down here... See, I'm taking you probably on the more underwhelming base first. <laughs> All good, all good, all good. Mine like was really un well underwhelming. When because... when we get to Mikey's base, you'll just be like, "Oh my heck!" <laughs> <laughs> my base like has sucked because oh man, I'm hungry. Uh, cause like I started so late and then the server is no closing, worries. So you know, <laughs> that was my base in a nutshell. So anyway, this was a now one thing I have never done on this server is strip mine. Why? I'm thinking that next time I do a server, I'm going to go ahead and strip mine. Oh. So this is a mine shaft, and there are like at least seven spider spawners that I found in here. Ooh. But the the pride and joy that everyone uses mine is uh, the skeleton farm. So this is my skelly yeah. grinder over here, and probably one of my better builds. Where is oh this? Ooh. So basically, if you if you're right here, the the spawner is actually just above you. Okay. And this just gets them far enough out of range that uh, the spawner will keep on going, that it doesn't detect that the skeletons are there. And then if you just wait a few seconds, they'll start dropping in. For minutes. Come on, skeletons! I, oh, there, there they go. go. I don't have a sword. So, They'll start dropping in, and then what you do is you oh, wait, close this to stop more from coming in. You hit the button here to Aye. soften them up a bit, and then you'll be able to uh, kill them a lot easier. Let's just... So you're welcome to use this and use the resources from it. Alright, thank you so much. That's going to help out a lot. <laughs> Alright, can I, can I... Oh, wow. Yep, yep. That's two hits with like nothing so that's awesome also uh, uh over here are the the bones sabrina took a ton of my bones so this chest is wow, less sabrina, than full now geez. well i i gave her the idea of making because she's really into dinosaurs yeah I know so I, I gave her the idea to uh make an archaeological dig oh. so Wait, that's oh. kind of what she's doing I think. Oh, bones. There we go. <laughs> so, yeah, there's bones in there. These are my parrots from the jungle. So, over here, I have lots of arrows because she didn't need arrows. She only took bones. <laughs> and then in these chests over here are just all various bones. Oh, that's and, great. You know, just do whatever you want. There's an ender chest here underneath the ender, or not the ender chest, the uh, enchantment table. Underneath the enchantment table is an anvil. Sabrina didn't see that. She was wondering where it was for a while. <laughs> she had to make one. And I'm like, no, you don't. Oh it's my under gosh. It. So anyway, there's that. Nice. That's very nice. So, and then, uh, of course, we have my... Uh, the, the skelly spawner used to be up here. And they used to go up and then drop 23 blocks right down through here onto a platform. Yes, yeah, the, the problem track. is, is with skeleton. Oh man, my keyboard's being weird on me. There we go. <laughs> uh, so the the problem is, is skeletons don't swim up anymore. And to get a water stream to meet up with the bubble elevator, not very easy. Mm -hmm. So I ended up moving it so they just do a quick little drop down instead. Yeah, that seems better. <laughs> so anyway, to come here, you just right there, you can actually see the door that we came in. So it's just straight off where this crafting bench is. Oh, yeah. Now I see it. Now I see it. Yeah. Oh, wait. And then the out. only okay. other thing that I'll show you about my base is the ugly resort that I've been making. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure it's not that ugly. It's pretty ugly. Just okay, so on that one, 
I'm going to say it's not as much my fault because I wanted the roof because you know how like uh, island resorts, they kind of have the grass roofs. Well, well, the hay blocks look really ugly because they have that red stripe in them and stuff. Yeah. So I used strip birch instead because it kind of does look like uh, I'll let you go out first. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh. <laughs> Where is this located and how far away is it? It's not very far, so I'll just show you. All right, cool. Which, which place are we going for first? Uh, the giant glass thing's fine. Okay. Wow, that took forever for my ender pearl to hit down. <laughs> Where are you? Okay, you. so uh, this wasn't going to have this big wall, but the dolphins kept jumping out. <laughs> Oh, so this is like a swim with the dolphins aquarium type thing. So you can Ooh. come in here and you you can breathe because I have the conduit right here that's full that gives like sixty four blocks. So fancy. And then you can just swim around and the dolphins I'm will chase so you know fast. follow you. I'm going so fast. And it, it's really fun. For some reason, people will just come oh, here like fish, all those dolphins fish. following you. Puffer fish. Yeah, puffer fish do like to spawn in here too. Ah! <laughs> But How you can you get so many them. dolphins? Oh my gosh. There are eight in here. Most of them are named just dolphin because I'm waiting for people to give them names. <laughs> like how- I, I feel like it'd be so difficult to get them though. Uh, you just use a lead. You can actually use a lead on them. Really? That's yes. Cool. Okay, I'm pretty sure they just ate my carrot. Uh, no, they're playing- they're playing with it. Okay, it looked like they ate it because all of a sudden it just disappeared. They they okay, no, they, they kind of eat it and shoot it out and just play with it because oh. that's you know what dolphins do. So, so they'll cute. all go after it and they'll knock it and swim around. So yeah, anyway, this is the uh... wow. It's our night. Yeah, is there a bed in that little place? I'm guessing there is because it's <laughs> actually there's a bed before that little place. It's the green one right next to right here. Oh, it's blocked because of the shulkers. I was like, where? Yes. <laughs> All right, I want to go check out this little... little. So it's not fully furnished yet. I but mean, this is an ugly dude. I would be so much worse at this. Well, I like the inside, and I like the, the layout and stuff. Like, I, I like that there's a, a swimming pool type thing out here. That you can just swim in, you know, and you can go back and forth and all that fun stuff. What I don't like is just how the roof looks. It, it wouldn't be half bad if we had slabs and stairs in that, in the strip birch and stuff. But yeah. I just think it kind of looks really ugly. It's a little bit weird, but that's okay. But there's nothing I could do about it. And then, of course, you can as Manor will be over there. That giant square will be a giant uh, face of mine. Because yeah. I'm vain. I don't. I don't see a square. I think I'm gonna have to turn up my red. Oh, red maybe red. your render distance isn't far enough. Um, That's okay. You don't need to see that. No, no. I'm, oh. I'm bringing it to 19. <laughs> I still don't see it. Well, you probably haven't rendered in that area just yet. Okay. You know what? We're going up to 32. I might destroy my computer, and I'm still not seeing <laughs> it. Or I am, and I just don't realize what it is. It. It's just a giant brown square in the in the side of the mountain there in the side of the mountain oh wait is that it i can't tell if that's it or not it's not like a big just a square it's just a square it has no depth right now at all how am i not seeing this <laughs> that's okay you'll see it in my future oh, video i think it's there i think it's that <laughs> Do you see now? I think I might. Is it like kind of far away over where uh, we went into that entrance? Kind of. Yeah. We'll Although that entrance that. is over this way. I'm confused on your base, but that's okay because it's cool. <laughs> so the easiest way to know where my base is, is it's the tall one that doesn't have lava spewing out of it. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I think can... it's over here. Hell yeah. Hey, I got farther by like a few blocks, but I did. Okay, right, right. That, here. so that mountain over there 
that has the lava coming out of it that's directly behind the waterfall. That's where my portal is, and that's where we're going next. I'm sorry. I just saw the square, and I feel like an idiot. <laughs> now you see the square. <laughs> <laughs> I promise I'm not this bad at Minecraft usually. No Today's worries. just an off day. <laughs> Here, let me turn down my render distance because I think my computer's going slow again. Slow-ish. My computer's actually decent, I think. Sort of. <laughs> so, really, there's only a couple other places that I'll probably show you because we're just taking too much time. Yeah. Um, but you definitely got to see Mikey's, and maybe I'll show you Camp Sea Pickles. Camp Sea Pickles? Yeah, that's a place where you can get all geared up. Okay. All right, so if we go back through the nether portal here. Sorry about that. No worries. There was once again parents and whatnot. <laughs> Still a child. Okay. So just back this way. Yep. Okay, great. You know boats go like super fast, right? The what? Boats on ice. Yes. I've just never made a boat yet um, for this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I need to. <laughs> well, I actually used to only have just a single uh, cobblestone path. But when my daughter moved into my base over there, she doesn't like that. So she put up the walls and the roof. And then uh, Wintry Eagle... Uh, who was on here, who's on here also, he put ice down on the bottom. Mm. This path is absolutely amazing. Yeah, that's that's how Mikey is. Everything he builds, just amazing, period. <laughs> <laughs> so his base is in a guardian farm. So, oh, by the way, do you have your particles down to minimal? Um, I have no idea. I can you better do that, just <laughs> before sure mine are too how to turn um, them up let's see let's okay see. minimal yep now they are all right it was on decrease yeah if they're on minimal you'll probably do okay here okay okay I, my computer's decently like beefy so yeah so is mine so uh this is his storage room wow i'm already impressed is it automatic no. Okay, not as impressed, but that's okay. Wow, that didn't work. <laughs> Love these things. Ooh, there we go. Oh. <laughs> you just have to keep walking forward, but like I said, because I'm uploading a video, I'm getting a little lag. You have to hit All the right. pressure plates. There we go. Okay, well, let's try this again. There we go. There you go. So this right here is his guardian farm. He's also got every tree known to Minecraft. Up here, the big trees down there where we just were is where all the smaller trees are. You can beautiful. see uh, <laughs> he's got lots and lots of... Jeez. Uh... Oh, oh my yeah, gosh. Yeah, if you need cooked fish, you can always get cooked fish here too. <laughs> and then he has just one, one mini head. <laughs> I think someone took him. Are there any down below? Oh, there's 26 oh. in that one. His fish are overflowing. I think those are more or less his flows. Mm -hmm. So anyway, what you can do is you come up here and yeah, this guardian farm. You I flip the lever TV here. Oh, not that lever. So Whoops, pretty. I mean that. Press the button there. And that, actually, I think he changed. Oh, it's this leather lever up here now. Now they'll fall through and they'll be low on damage. Mm -hmm. If you turn off the water, then they'll bounce around. Yeah, I, I don't have a sword, still. So. <laughs> yeah, it won't work. Alright, let's kill him again. So anyway, this is the bottom of Mikey's thing. This is the under... This is the not as awesome part. Wait, I mean, it's what? still There's totally awesome. awesome. It's totally awesome, but his upper part, it's just mind-blowing. Oh, man. What, how long does this guy spend on Minecraft? <laughs> Quite a bit. So right here is the up elevator, bubble vader. Bubble vader. Yeah. And here's where you get blown away. Whoa. <laughs> oh my gosh. So he's been on my server probably since January. What? And this is a 
he the, he breeds all these uh, iron golems here are natural. Mobs don't spawn because he's got everything lit up. This thing that says TNT on it is his uh, stone factory where it blows up the stone. Also his creeper farm. These two over here, the twin towers over here, are his um, hostile mob farms. Then he has, uh, in this building over here, he has all his animal farms. They're all manual. And then these two green things above you are like different, uh, your carrots and wheat and all that stuff. I am... Oh, oh my gosh. This and is then crazy. on the two ends, if you go to this end oh over here, gosh. and then <laughs> these round things, these are um, humane iron farms. Oh. And you might be able to see the other one. There's two of these. Yeah, can you see the other one over there? Nah, I turned my render distance down again. Uh, well, it's just on the other side. I go like if that? you go in here... He, he doesn't want to be mean to villagers. Let's see how much iron he's got or if someone's raided it. A lot of flowers. I think this side's the iron. Whoa, my gosh. Fair amount. So if we go over here and go up, we can see... Uh, this is just a swim up one. Okay. So this is his villager cells. But as you can see, they're just free roaming. They can harvest the wheat here. And inside the... Whoa, they're all, all in there having a... Whoa. But inside there, you can see is the actual part where the iron golems spawn and fall down and stuff. But they're completely neat. free roaming up here. They're not trapped in a little water cell like most people do. This is so amazing, dude. I am breathtaking. I can't do anything this amazing. I'm going to say that right now. Don't expect a lot from me, but I'm not as bad as i shown today. <laughs> And then I think this is the down one. He does have boats at the very bottom, so you don't have to shift before you hit the magma. Oh. You just hit the the boat. Smart. And then walk out. Really so anyway, that. this is Cyberperion. Way, way up at the top where that creeper face is. Can you see that? Or is your render distance not that far up? I'll, 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 I'll bring it back up. I'll so if you come back up. where I am, you'll be able to see it. Okay. Yep, everything's loading up. It's getting a little bit of lag, but that's okay. Do you uh, see the creeper face in the top up there? No. Oh, wait, yep. Yep, I see it. So above that's a little, like, star thing, and that's so that you can pay and the creepers will still spawn, but the guardian farm directly below us uh, won't be in loaded, so you don't oh, use up those chunks. That's awesome. And then he has his uh, hostile mob farm on the opposite side. But... I uh yeah, that's that's Mikey's base. I that's never... why I never start the tour off with Mikey's base, because then we'll get to mine with like, bleh. <laughs> Dude, yours is... Okay, well, compared to this, no offense, it, it's, you know. Oh, I take no offense. Mikey is an incredible builder. <laughs> I thought that... I personally thought that, like, Die Kick was amazing, like, played so much, and like, oh my gosh, you know? And then I see Mikey. <laughs> yeah, Die Kick's stuff is really cool, too. He actually joined the server as well. He's, he, die kick's really good, but I'm sorry, Mikey takes the win. Yeah, Mikey's amazing. So anyway, uh, that's pretty much it. Um, All right, well then let's take our closing. Bye everyone. If you guys like this video, you guys know what to do. Hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. Also, go check out Taz's channel because he's awesome. He, he's he's really cool. So, come over here, Taz. Street. This is the way back down, by the way. Oh, okay, great, great. We're, we're going to have to take that. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, well, this is a new series. We'll definitely be on the server playing a lot. This time, we're actually going to get started on our base first before any creeper farms that mess up 100%. Yeah, a quick warning, I cannot make any farms functional. Which sucks, because I'm a redstone kind of guy. <laughs> so, you know... <laughs> Okay, maybe I am a bad <laughs> Minecrafter now that I'm thinking about it. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope that you guys enjoyed this tour, and I hope to see you guys soon. Bye!